there are actually three things that I'd like to chat with you about. The first is family. The second is your friends. And the third and the last thing that I'd like to chat with you about is you. So family, friends and you are what I'd like to discuss with you today. So let's start with family. I am sure that everyone understands the basic idea of a family. In some cases, a family involves two parents, one side, and a child or children on the other. In many cases, it involves only one parent. We refer to them as single parents, and then the child or children. In other cases, it involves no parents at all, just the child or children, and an adult relative like a grandmother or grandfather, or an auntie or an uncle. Any one of these combinations is, is what we sometimes call the nuclear family. But there is also what we call the extended family. And today, I want us to think of our extended family, not just as our parents and relatives, but as all of those adults whom children love and who love children and who sacrifice for children so that children can be all that they can be. So in this category, I want us to think of our extended family as including persons like our teachers. We all have our favorite teachers. We know that these teachers care about us and we like how they make us feel important and special. So I'd like us to think of teachers like that as being part of our extended family.